We are boiling our collard green leaves, stem and all. We are making sarma, which is, instead of stuffed cabbage, it is stuffed collard green leaves, which is a very typical traditional dish from the Black Sea region of Turkey. And what you want to do is you can see your meat is sort of mashing down gently so that the leaves are immersed in the water. After you're sort of parboiling this, you're doing this for about two minutes. It's a very quick process. You do you um, cook this, you cook the collard green leaves with the stems on, and now we're going to remove it from the water. So now that the leaves have been parboiled, we are cutting them to make them smaller and we're removing the center vein from the leaf. And then set it aside in a bowl. Uh, do you use the steams for anything? You can also pound the center vein and soften it up a little bit if you don't want to remove it. Now we're making the filling for our sarma and we have our parsley that we're chopping finely. We have raw rice. We have our ground meat and we're going to combine everything. Grant beef. Mm. And tomatoes. Tomatoes. Paste. Mm -hmm. Tomato paste, a heaping tablespoon. Mm. Red pepper. And paper. Pepper Red paste. paste. Yes. Filling. We are now adding some paprika. Mm -hmm. Dr dry mint. And dried mm -hmm. mint. Cumin, a sprinkle or two of cumin. Yes. And some black pepper to taste. Ah, and the secret ingredient is sumac, which is a little bit on the tart side. Looks like about a teaspoon. Mm -hmm. Never tried it? One teaspoon salt. Oh, one cup each. One cup each. Add some oil to your mixture, and your meat and your rice are equal amounts. And chopped onion. Hot 
make the canned salsa. Does she have a recipe for the salmon? Oh, yes. It's okay. Oops. If you notice, there's a plate that's been placed on top of the stuffed sarma, and that keeps the weight down. And then you cover this with a lid and cook it for about half an hour. It's also, the water comes up, barely touches the top of the rolled sarma. It's cooking, it's at a gentle boil, and notice that this plate, the weight of the plate keeps the sarma from moving while it is gently boiling. The other important thing is you want to keep this covered for about half an hour while it is cooking. You start out uh, bringing it to a boil and then you lower it to a gentle rolling boil and keep it at about a medium heat. And you cook it for about half the an sarma hour. sarma is coming to a faster boil. It's been cooking for about 25 minutes or so. And you want to keep this covered as it cooks. A lot of the juices are being released from the filling and will make a very nice sauce. And it's